Hey guys, it's Matt Fowler with 3540 Media with a quick tip in Adobe Premiere on how to give your videos that CinemaScope look. Uh, CinemaScope look is basically a letterbox on top or bottom and bottom of your videos. You'll notice that in a lot of the DVDs and Blu-rays you'll watch will have those black bars because they were shot in a 239 to 1 aspect ratio and I like to add that to videos to give them a more cinematic feel. So how do we do that? Well, there's a couple of ways. First method is pretty easy. If you will go to effects and to search for crop you can drag that on to a clip and in the effects controls you'll get this and for the cinemascope you want to put about 13 percent on the top and 13 percent on the bottom and you'll get this which that is all well and dandy except when we shot this video it was a quick shoot we were just doing a little test for fun so we weren't really shooting for a cinemascope aspect ratio and as you can see the framing of the shot is not very good now because the top of his head's cut off and well with the crop effect to do this you have no flexibility in terms of reframing the shot so what I like to do instead is put a crop effect on a clip so you can see what the bars will be and you can have it however you want 13 percent I think is just gives you a nice look but once you have that, go over to your bin, your project window, I mean, and make a new title. Then once you have that window up, make pick the rectangle tool, give it a black fill then use those crop bars on the top and bottom as a guide to draw rectangles on the top and bottom of the screen for some reason these change to white you want to pick black or maybe you don't want to pick black it can be any color you want uh, shadow that all looks good alright once you have that what you can do is take that title we'll rename it cinemascope Crop and drag that above your footage in the timeline and on the top track then you can kind of drag it make it cover the whole timeline and you can delete that crop effect from any clips you have it on make this video visible so we can see it and then you have the bars but you also have the flexibility of reframing your shot so it fits with that cinemascope look all you have to do is select a clip go to its effects controls and change the position the second one to somewhere where it looks better. If you go too far, of course that'll happen. 
but it gives you a little bit of more flexibility to reframe your shots after you've applied the letterbox effect. This has been Matt with 3540 Media. Hope you enjoyed this little quick tip for Adobe Premiere. Let me know what you think in the comments. Thanks.